Megan's uh, uh, wedding because quick shout out yeah. at the beginning of this thing. Congratulations to our good friends of the podcast, Tommy Fitzgerald and Megan mm. for their great wedding they had over the weekend. So congratulations to them. Honestly, uh, it was nice because like you teased a bit, you know, we were at Tommy and Megan's wedding this week and everything. That was a great time. And um, what I was very surprised by from the beginning and also on the way, you know, literally back is how short the drive ended up actually being. I was not expecting that at all. It was under three and a half hours, both to and from Virginia, which I was not expecting at all. So that was, that was a nice surprise. We were, clo- we were closer to four hours on the ride down. Yeah. Wait, but you guys still, left. You guys left earlier than we did because we left around noon and didn't get there until like maybe like ten fifteen minutes before this uh, rehearsal yeah. was going to start. Yeah, no, I um, I was definitely uh, surprised by that. No, it was it was nice though. So um, the only thing that like when on the ride back, thankfully Danny suggested this is we got out of the car because to make a pit stop, we had like just under an hour left, and I did not realize how like sore and like stiff my legs were and everything like that. I, I, it, like I, I felt fine on the way down. It was just on the way back for some reason just extremely sore and stiff and just like when we got up i, I felt like my knees were and my legs were like on their deathbed <laughs> yeah right yeah for some reason my back i don't know if it was because the ride down yeah. because i was sleeping on a pullout couch the whole weekend but my back was just stacking up for most of the weekend i don't know why so it's doing better today but for some reason just the whole weekend it was just kind of bugging me yeah like, kind of stiff kind of thing yeah and, and sometimes it, it doesn't help when like you're spe- sleeping in a new spot you know um because yeah. it could it takes you like a day or two to get used to it and then by the time you're used to it, like well gotta get in the car for a couple hours yeah great. and anyone who's <laughs> listening to this can kind of understand that either being on a car for so long you kind of stiffen up or sleeping on like a pull out couch like they're not the most comfy thing to begin with anyways i want to go back to tommy's wedding for a second though um i got i got some stories i gotta share um, yeah. the one, the one, the one Jeff's laughing about right now is the one I'm going to tell last, um, save the best for last, obviously. Uh, but first I have one and it's funny, but there, there's one minor, very minor con- critique I have of the wedding. It has nothing to do with the wedding itself. Nothing about the venue, nothing about the food, nothing about the ceremony, nothing at all. But I don't know if you noticed on the board that it said everyone's name on it. <laughs> My last name was spelled wrong. If it makes you feel better, so was Matt's. <laughs> if it makes you feel better, so was Matt's. So you're not alone. There was a few we noticed. Some of the guys and I, we did notice a few last names that were misspelled. Like, oh, whoops. And so, because Matt, he he noticed that right away for yours. And then he he's talking about us, and I heard him say about his too. I was like. I thought he was just joking because he's like, oh, you know, you know how he is. He's yeah, like, yeah, oh, yeah. like, oh, he's like, oh, and he pretends to be all serious. Oh, what the heck, man? You just spelled my name mm-hmm. wrong, too. So I was like, oh, ha, ha, good one. And we'll look up and it's like Bev Manure. <laughs> and I lost it. I was like, I mean, yours was literally just an added extra letter. His yeah. wasn't that close. No, but it's the way that I think most, I haven't seen it spelled that way since like when I was back in school. <laughs> Because whenever people think, oh, whenever say it's Mike Whitmer, they for some reason, some reason or people think H. it's W H, <laughs> and it's not. At that point, it's like Whitmer. Yeah, it's Whitmer, but it's not Whitmer. As this, as our podcast, our hockey podcast, yes. we haven't done in years at this point, which feels like it. Uh, it's Whitmer W I, not W H. You know. <laughs> hey, you know, well, I, I, had, I did see that. that was I did one, feel one bad. minor thing. <laughs> The other thing, too, that I found funny because I had to kill a couple hours while you guys were getting ready for yeah. the wedding itself uh, that day. So I was just kind of in the hotel room, people watching and kind of looking through the hotel. The hotel was kind of cool they were staying at because it was a little suite style yeah. uh, that came with like a little kitchen with it. Uh, it yeah, had like no, a full fridge, nice. freezer, dishwasher, yep. microwave, and a uh, sink. And the one thing I found funny was because I was going through the like, drawers and everything, they had a strainer for some reason. <laughs> I don't know when you're going to be able to use that wait, wait, in the kitchen. I don't know when you're going to be so able to. Sense. When the only thing, 
<laughs> no. And the only thing you could use is a microwave and one toaster that they had. No, it's so it's so funny you mentioned that because I I clocked that when I went to return B- Brian's um, bag to him because somehow I accidentally grabbed uh, uh, for the after the wedding. Uh, it was on Sunday morning, I think, before we went to the brunch. Uh, I had accidentally grabbed Brian's uh, suit bag. Uh, by the way, I still need to return my suit, so I'm doing that later because um, we only have a couple of days to re- drop it off at UPS. And yeah, you want to do that before you forget to. Exactly. Um, which technically, I need to do it by like tomorrow at the latest because I because they're saying three days after the wedding and. I, Technically, the first day was Sunday. Technically, today was the second day. So I need to get that. Oh, yeah. Yes. Anywho, but no, so I gave that back and I just see the strainer just sitting out and it was randomly. On. I saw it. I was like, yeah, okay, whatever. And I didn't think anything of it, but that's so funny. Though. It's made no sense for it's it to so be in random. there. <laughs> There's hey, no stove. Uh, There's nothing you could use it for. It's, I mean, hey, you could get creative. I guess there's a full sink, so yeah, I guess. But no, the just when I saw, was... I saw the strain, it's easy to mention the strain. I'm like, oh my, just oh my god, it's just funny. <laughs> Number two is I was looking because I had we had the window, uh, the curtains up, and I was kind of people mm. watching outside the our, um, hotel, and and at the across the street from the hotel was a daycare, right? And I don't know if that daycare or something was, or there was people going to a Halloween party, but I saw two people dressed as cows, what I believe were cows. It could have been Dalmatians or zebras, whatever. And then <laughs> I saw the flash. I saw the flash. You saw the flash? Oh, yeah. man. Look at you. I was like, what is going on over seen, there? Seeing everything, dude. I know. That's so funny. So you saw two cow costumes and someone dressed up as the flash. That's yeah, fantastic. I was like, what is going on over there? <laughs> I was very tempted to send a snap. It's like, oh, I just saw this flash. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. And now the one that we've all been waiting for, for the people who were actually <laughs> at the wedding. Um, so I had another little thing at a wedding. So as you do with most, or maybe some, but the way we do it, and Tommy did call us out during the reception, uh, that we would be <laughs> oh, the yeah, rowdy group. Right. The rowdy table. Um, so obviously, somebody at the rowdy table, you know, couldn't keep it together. Uh, but what was crazy was, and we were saying it like the whole night. Essentially, every, it was like every those hour drinks is, yeah. just like didn't feel no. Wrong. Like we just like we were really no, like, not at all. We were like, oh, to is- be fair, not at all. And like when we even asked our like, other people in the group and they, and they agreed that like, like dude, not like nothing. It, yeah, like at some point I was like having a conspiracy theory in my mind. I was like, are they watering down their alcohol? Because like I'm not feeling anything here. <laughs> but yeah. it wasn't until it wasn't until when we had those Manhattans near the end because you you asked me what was the strongest thing you had so far, and then we were going to get another strong drink, and I had said just the old fashioned because cause normally old fashions would be strong, but right. they. So then we're to like, we're just, fair, gonna get some old, we're just going to get some yeah. Manhattans. <laughs> yeah. Well, to be fair, we just got the one. Yeah, just the one. And then after that, clearly, it just went from all-time peak to just literally take one more step and just fall right in the face. Yeah, pretty much. Um, but yeah, I was feeling fine and everything, too. The wedding came to an end. Um, and then we had to take the shuttles back. And the ride back was a half hour or so, back and forth. Yeah, from reception to where at we're least at. again, at least there was a shuttle, which we were very grateful for. Yeah. Um, and I was getting tired at this point, so by the time I kind of sat down and they were like two minutes into sitting down on the bus, I just just kind of passed out. Yeah. Uh, and at some point, I may have vomited on myself yeah. on the bus ride back poor poor Whitmer poor yeah. man yeah yeah just it, it was it, it was, was crazy the craziest thing about it was I felt fun the entire night 
<laughs> you, just I wasn't until like I got into the do. bus when I got like a little tired, and yeah, I was like taking a nap. I was like half, like, weird... a, I was half asleep when it happened. Yeah. I thought it was yeah. like I thought it was gonna be one of those things where I felt like a burp coming up and it wasn't. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it wasn't. By the way, so I'll I'll send you the picture, but there is one picture in the middle of the, uh you know that 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 we all took. But I, you you so I just sent it to you. Just this is the moment we should have known you were gone. Lo- zoom in and look at your face. I'm still waiting for it to come. No. Okay, it says it, it says it's, it just got delivered, but but if, if you zoom in on that photo I just sent you, just look at your face and that explains everything you need to know. <laughs> but um you know, it was unreal because we were all just sitting yep, there. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. 